Hi everyone, so today's video we will be talking about Amazon Summer School, Amazon ML Summer School. This is an opportunity through which you can not only get a chance to interview for some of the roles at Amazon, but you will also get some additional perks in terms of a lot of sessions based upon machine learning and stuff like that. So today we have with us Deepak who has cracked this particular opportunity last year coming from a village in Andhra Pradesh and he has uh, grab this opportunity. So we'll be talking with him regarding how he grabbed this opportunity. And this is currently live. You can also go and participate in this particular challenge. So this entire conversation will help you understand that. How can you prepare for it? What are the things that you should keep in mind? So make sure you watch this video till the end, right? So starting this conversation with Deepak. Hi Deepak. How are you doing? Uh, I would like just like you to briefly introduce yourself. Sure. Uh, hello, so I'm Deepak. So I'm currently in my final year pursuing BTEC in electrical and computer engineering at Amrita Vishwavidyalaya in Kannur, Tamil Nadu. So I'm from Pothavaram, a village in West Godavari, Andhra Pradesh, and also I was a proud participant of ML Summer School 2022. And currently working as Affairs and the Internet Amazon. Great, great. So, uh, just wanted to understand, like, how did you get to know about this opportunity when you applied last year? So, was this uh, something that was off campus? Was that this told to you by your uh, placement committee or by your college? So, how did you get to know about this? Uh, this was completely off campus, actually. Uh, last year, uh, it was the first year being open to type uh, two and type three colleges. So, uh, right from my second year. I had this habit of uh, applying to all student ambassador programs and internship. Like I, I applied to few uh, student ambassador programs like GDSC, Intel student ambassador, etc. Mm -hmm. And even I applied for uh, Google Step, Microsoft Engage, etc. Program. Likewise, I also had applied to Michelani Summer School 2022, and it was their first year being open to Tier Two and Tier Three colleges. Mm -hmm. um, I was also able to make it to. Uh, as an Intel student ambassador, deep learning at AI, when, um, AI ambassador, and uh, machine learning summer school. So combining all these experience, uh, like it had a great impact on my learnings uh, from these experiences. Understood, understood. So if I talk about uh, the specific perks and benefits, like what is uh, it that you get out from this opportunity? Let's say if somebody selected for Amazon ML summer school, what are the perks and benefits that he or she would get? Sure. Um, actually, Amazon Summer School is an exciting opportunity for ML enthusiasts like us and you uh, to learn machine learning taught by applied scientists at Amazon. These uh, uh, lessons include supervised learning, deep neural networks, probabilistic graphical models, dimensional reduction, and unsupervised techniques. Apart from just this learning, you'll also get a chance to interact with uh, scientists at Amazon on Q&A sessions. So uh, how will be the program? The program will take place on weekends. There will be eight modules. Uh, so the program is starting from September 16 of this uh, year. It will take place on Saturday and Sundays. Typically, the program schedule will be morning 9 to 1. Uh, there will be module teaching of different topics and 1 to 2 for the lunch break. And 2 to 5, uh, you'll probably get connected with uh, Amazon scientists. Uh, problems you know somewhere and you'll get an opportunity to interact with them you can ask a question and they, you'll get to know uh, your uh, answer so the best thing when i was attending the ml summer school 2022 was even if i miss one module uh, I, could, I couldn't attend it uh, you can even request the recording and watch it before the program concludes so automatically the request link will expire a uh, few days after the program con concludes actually so mm -hmm. right now the registrations are already started from August 22nd and it ends on September 6th. Uh, there will be a test that will be taken on September 9th where you need to attend two parts. Uh, the first part being there will be 22 uh, MCQs on basic ML concepts and math fundamentals like stats, uh, probability and linear algebra. And uh, part two will contain another uh, two programming questions. Uh, it can be easier, medium, liquid question. So the overall test duration will be one hour. So, uh, and also I'll suggest everyone to complete, complete this test as soon as possible because some of my friends have faced technical issues last year. It will be, I think, uh, uh, will be taken place on metal uh, testing platform. And uh, even sometimes even maybe your submission time can be considered while selecting you. 
so mm-hmm. last year around 18k uh, participants were uh, applied for it and the top 3000 was selected for uh, michelin learning summer school 2022 uh this year this program is further expanded to include more engineering students from all over the college all over the campuses in india and uh, we can expect uh, a large participation as well this year mm-hmm. understood understood so if i talk about like you talk, you told about the pox in manifests like there will be several sessions by people who are working at amazon you will get a chance to interact with them network with them right apart from that uh, you yeah. mm-hmm. get a chance to interview at uh, amazon right so what is this interview all about do everyone get a chance to interview so what was the ratio last year if you if you have some idea about the same sure so uh, okay our uh, some year already into uh, amal summer school 2023 uh, so what's next so la- last year we expected an hackathon will be conducted at the end of the program and people will be picked up for internships and full times through it but uh, that time everyone just got an email for an internship opening of apply and just intern and uh, even there there will be there can be other roles like data scientists Uh, the data scientist is only open to master graduates and even there are other roles like research scientists etc mm-hmm. so uh, yeah you can uh, you probably uh, get a chance for an hackathon or uh, directly an interview opportunity that depends on the conclusion of the program and you'll, you'll get to know when you start attending it actually okay and for the test that you mentioned right so there would be one test conducted mm-hmm. so if somebody wants to prepare for different different topics that you mentioned uh, part 1 and part 2 so what all things can one follow or any any particular syllabus that you have in mind that one can follow for that test so for the math being it just included probability stats and linear algebra you can uh, refer some of the stanford's uh, courses on this topics or even the youtube playlist and the ml concepts are very basic uh, for this online test which includes a uh, simple uh, questions like so calculate in the confusing matrix uh, etc etc so you'll get to uh, you'll get question uh, kind of and basic ml questions in this uh, test actually understood so this is the test that somebody needs to prepare after this test right the Mm-hmm. all 3000 which were shortlisted were given a chance to participate or were there some interviews also conducted to be a part uh, for the ml summer school there were no interviews uh, when you uh, shortlisted uh, from the online test then uh, you will first you will get uh, you know the startup gifts like bottles and a note notebook something like that then uh, probably uh, after uh, i think on september 16 the program will start live and you can start attending the program understood 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 so so if i if i talk about your experience of the program how it has been till now like you have been selected last year right so what was the experience if i talk about of the program so uh, yeah cool so like everyone else applied for it uh, some people were uh, actually from that application that i spoke before some people are moved to another online test which is purely uh, to programming questions and after the after giving the programming question uh, people were shortlisted based on resume screening too and i was one of them later for the uh, apply scientist intern role there will be two round of two rounds of interviews one will be dsa test Uh, one will be DSA round and another one is ML breadth and depth round, which will be taken by senior applied scientists at Amazon. So, if I talk about uh, somebody who wishes to appear for applied scientist interviews, right? So, what are the things that he or mm-hmm. she should take into consideration? DSA is one part, right? Apart from data structure algorithms, what else uh, he or she should prepare for this in these so, interviews? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, uh, actually, this was my first ever internship given. So. my preparation strategy was like uh, i don't know how to attend a, how to be in interview so i started browsing through all the resources and past interview experiences i started preparing notes about all the questions that were asked in past science science interviews even the full time science interviews the full time uh, science interviews consist of five rounds actually so mm. Uh, uh, I prepared a separate list for DSA initially for round one for ML and another separate list for uh, uh, machine learning uh, and also I revised my past courses of uh, 
machine learning related topics like neural networks perceptron uh, cnn rnn on all the content from mlsm 2022 that uh, that is the most important one actually we should uh, get a in depth grip in mlsm 2022 and uh, uh, supervised learning techniques and an introduction to deep learning when i was um, when i gave my interview so they even might expect more from you this year we, we couldn't uh, you know freeze in a zone so my whole ex- procedure took around 8 months because of an amazon hiring freeze in between uh, there was a you know people were being removed out and then uh, there was an hiring freeze and uh, so uh, around after 8 months that is uh, the end of the program which which is in august i uh, august something i guess Uh, I gave my interview. Uh, in, uh, I gave my online test in August. Uh, I gave my interview at September, and uh, there was a, this complete silence from September to uh, February. At the end of Feb, I got an email saying that uh, you move to next round, that is machine learning round, and choose your date for the slot. So. There were just ten uh, days. There were just two two dates that were available to me. uh and there was just 10 days of gap so i started uh, preparing all uh, i told you uh, earlier right there mm-hmm. were uh, some previous questions that uh, i scraped from internet uh, through the past experiences and everything so like uh, yeah there were around uh, i guess 100 to 150 questions that i could able to uh, get from internet and by observing through that it covers almost everything starting from a traditional machine learning algorithm uh, to random forest decision trees and to uh, deep learning techniques it kind of uh, covered almost everything uh, then uh, yeah, on actually september on march second week the most happiest of my uh, college life i got the intensive offer so uh, moving on that getting an intensive as a five, fifth semester student was unprecedented at my college uh, as there is no time for an intensive in my curriculum until my last semester so understandably my uh, college uh, was initially skeptical but yeah with the support of my professors at hod and d i am working on this incredible journey at amazon delhi office right now great 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 so uh, generally we are aware about software engineering role at uh, amazon right roles and responsibilities what a software mm-hmm. engineer does how this applied scientist role is different from a software engineer like in terms of the type of work you do in terms of the stipend you get how much is the difference and how different is this role sure uh, i think the stipend for sd intern and uh, soft uh, applies and this intern is around same but uh, it varies when it comes when it when it is coming to full time op- full time opportunities uh, there will be a c 1 2 3 1 and likewise there will be applied scientist 1 2 3 as well so generally applied scientist role can involves data science and sd work as well i think uh, as far as i have observed till now there will be one applied scientist working with uh, 100 sds and definitely at some point of time you need to uh, know software development for integrating your tools with your team mm-hmm. so uh, moving on that you should have software development experience like uh, the devops and etc to you know inculcate your ml tools with the team understood 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 and uh, any any final piece of advice that you have for students who will be applying for this opportunity this year like you want to share something Sure. Um, also, uh, let me share my experience at Amazon initially. So it was around uh, one and a half month working in. I'm working in fintech actually, finance technology at Amazon. So mm-hmm. finance technology plus machine learning is challenging. When you should con- you should be almost uh, uh, correct every time when you're giving a probabilistic answer uh, in finance, or it will lead to uh, errors in uh, real money. So the work culture at Amazon is also vastly different from academic projects. Here there is strong em- emphasis on uh, leadership principles and customer obsession, the philosophy of uh, working backwards from customers, and yeah, it is an exciting transformation for me. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, uh, th- yeah, a uh, thank you note. Uh, thanks, thanks to us for inviting me here. And also, I like his idea of you know reducing the gap between the Tyrone and Tyre three students uh, from colleges. 
uh, when it coming when it's coming to opportunities uh, bringing up exciting opportunities to everyone who is who is on youtube so yeah if you are inspired don't forget to subscribe to channel and give me give, give this video a thumbs up and uh, uh, always remember you know after the hiring freeze uh, last year or even this month or last month amazon is slowly transitioning right now and uh, th- there might be or might not be same level of openings but we should give your best uh, finally to everyone watching this remember the pi- the path might be challenging and sometimes like unexpected too but the destination is worth it actually and if i never imagine where i would be today uh, especially coming from a tier 3 uh, private engineering college and non tier background amazon was my first interview ever given so if i can make it so can you always give your best wishing everyone for their uh, all the best for their future endeavors thank you great 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 thank you so much deepak i believe this would be very helpful for people who are applying for this opportunity this year uh, thank you so much for sparing some time and sharing your journey this would be really really very helpful thank you so much once again thank you thank you